Hey everyone, this is David again with Royal and today I'm going to show you how to simplify your digital life with OneDrive for Office 365. Now you might be asking, what is OneDrive? Well, OneDrive is a cloud storage option, um, again, that's built into Office 365 and the reason that's important is because it's fully integrated um, with your other Office applications and it makes working, editing, and saving from anywhere really, really easy. So um, reasons to use OneDrive, maybe you're tired of emailing yourself documents, maybe you're tired of using thumb drives or USB drives, maybe you're tired of forgetting to save the latest version, or perhaps you forgot to email that one file right before you left the office. Well, not to worry, OneDrive makes it easy to recover from those kind of situations and actually prevent the majority of those situations from ever becoming a problem. Um, so I'm going to show you how uh, OneDrive is a cloud storage option that works across all of your devices. That's kind of the first example that we're going to lead into here. So if I go to my OneDrive for Business, click this here. This is my local OneDrive. This is on my hard drive. Um, any file that I copy into this folder will automatically be synced to the cloud. So let me kind of show you here what the cloud version looks like. And I can access the cloud version of OneDrive by going to your office portal which is kind of your one-stop shop for Office 365 you can access your email your calendar everything that you could do um, you know with the applications on your computer like Outlook and things like that you can also do online so if you guys don't know how to find the portal this is how you find it you just go to uh, Office 365 portal It'll go to Google or Bing, and then it pops up right here, portal.office.com. Go ahead and sign in. And here we are. Let me log into OneDrive. So this is OneDrive. You can see here that the same files on my hard drive or also in my OneDrive. If I drag and drop a file like World Discounts logo into my OneDrive for business on my hard drive, it will sync. And then if I refresh my cloud version, there it is right there. So pretty cool stuff. Um, there's one terabyte of storage and you can see it's as simple as dragging and dropping. So the second trick I'm going to show you is how to share files and collaborate in real time with OneDrive. So let's say we had a, a notebook that that I want to share. I'm going to go ahead and share this with Trina. Workbook, feel free to edit. So there'll be a, uh, a box here where you can edit or you can view. In this case, I want Trina to be able to edit this file. And uh, she's going to get an email invitation. I also want her to be signed in so that only she can access this file. All I have to do is click share. And that's it. Trina has access to the file now. Um, in terms of collaboration, maybe you're concerned about the edits that uh, that are being made on a specific document. You can actually right click and go to version history and see um, who's worked on it, what time they worked on it, what version number it is. As you can see I'm the only one that worked on this particular file um, but if others were to be collaborating at the same time it would actually have a modified the username, the version number and all that good stuff so you could easily keep track there. Um, Lastly, I'm going to show you how OneDrive integrates into OneNote, allowing you to store your notes virtually in the cloud. And we'll just go back to my notebook here. I can open in OneNote online, or I can just open in OneNote, and you'll see it's actually going to pull up my OneNote on my hard drive. So here are the notes for my webinar. I made a few changes, and I would like to see them reflected in the cloud. I'm going to go ahead and exit out of this. Now if I open this in OneNote online, 
I should see those edits instantly. And here they are. It's that simple. Um, that's all folks. My name is David with Royal and I just showed you how to simplify your digital life with OneDrive and OneNote online. Thanks for joining.